Yo, what is up, guys? Nick here. Today I am. Uh, today I just want to talk about Five Nights at Freddy's and what I think the third game would look like. And um, yeah, I just put this image up to get it started. And these are all the animatronics we have. This was not Fred Bear's Family Diner, though. It was not Fred Bear's Family Diner. It was, um, it says presumably, but it w these were from the old location that was left to, these four were from the old location that was left to rot, but Golden Freddy, he was from F Fred Bear's Family Diner. Um, that's all the information I've gathered so far, and this is Generation 2, 1987, the toy animatronics. Generation 3, 1993, moving on. So listen, hang on, skip ahead. So, I went on scottgames.com and found this picture. I know you guys think it's fake, but it's not. And, um, I actually did go on to scottgames.com. I asked Google to direct me to Scott Games, and it, and it appeared to be... Um, it appeared to be this picture, but when I entered the website, it was this picture. So, um, both pictures here, and as you can see, we got the face here, and then, um, we took the image here, and it was actually, this image here, when I downloaded it, it was labeled naturally, as you can see, what we can use. So, um, I think the company, or Scott, is thinking of what we can, what he can use, what's his copyright, what's their copyright or something, and what he can use as his own characters. Or the company's thinking what we can use is take apart the animatronics and make them newer. And then um, we see this one. It's the same photo except it's it has a big lighting effect. And as you can see, you could probably see it, but probably not. It's a big man something in the corner. And um, actually, right here, somebody pointed it out and said that that's Golden Freddy. I think it's Golden Freddy 2. This guy did a nice job of um, pointing everything out. And um, this is a, actually this this image. Somebody put a light effect on it um, and put it light all the way. And then flipped in and copied it, flipped it over, and made this face. Which is like really wild and it's super cool. Um, and so then what I wanted to show you guys is that I actually cropped it down to this man. Let's get let's get a closer look at him so we could study him better. We could see that he has a golden suit. And look, if you look closely right at his eyes, you can see that um, it's kind of the same as the face. It's kind of the same as the face. Let me pull it up again. Yeah, kind of same as that face right there it's kind of it's kind of the same as you can see the little gray here i'm pointing my mouse but you guys probably can't see it um the gray the gray under the eyes so and um actually somebody did a really good job and made this picture which looks absolutely awesome and it blends in perfect because of the kind of little snout thing it blends in perfect with the current golden freddy suit and um, let's have a look at all the animatronics so far. And as you can see, Golden Freddy has kind of that snout too. He has, yeah, he does have the, kind of that snout in both games. All of them do. Um, and it looks like there's a snout here, so that's obviously Golden Freddy. And here's Golden Freddy, which obviously has a little snout, but, like, it's not really the same. But, hey, this is this game is presumably supposed to take place at Fred Bear's Family Diner. So, yeah. D it's just early development days, guys. Don't, bl don't blame me. Blame Fred Fazbear. Blame Fazbear Entertainment. Well, not Fazbear Entertainment. They didn't own the company before. Moving on. Uh, that's basically it. I just wanted to talk about my theories. Me and my friend put it all together. Heck, we even found we even found the um these pictures. Well, we didn't make them. We found them on the internet. Um, and this one's actually really cool. I renamed most of them, except um this one. This one was naturally labeled labeled what we can use. And some guy says that this one was nat naturally enabled FNAF three as in Five Nights at Freddy's 3. So, uh, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, I just wanted to talk about my theories on Five Nights at Freddy's, and here's the chart again. Here's a little chart. 
Um, I just wanted to talk about my theories on Five Nights at Freddy's and Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Obviously, Scott is teasing us out um, about the game, and we're super excited. Scott, if you see this video, we're excited for Five Nights at Freddy's 3, and if you didn't want us to find out, you think we'd go on your website? It's kind of obvious if you're teasing it out to us. Seriously. But still, uh, yeah, um... Actually, I'm gonna sh before I go, I'm gonna show a quick clip of something that I'm kind of working on right now. It's not really what I'm working on, but it's just something I I like to do in Gary's mod, and it's really fun. Um, I'll just show you guys. So uh, yeah, that's basically it. Um, comment, rate, and subscribe as always, and I will see you guys in one second. Yo, what is up, guys? Nick here, and I am back, and um. I'm in Gary's mod in front of all the um, Five Nights at Freddy's 2 animatronic characters. And um, all I did was spawn in the Five Nights at Freddy's original NPCs that we have right here. Um, and I and for these guys over here, I just reskinned them from the Five Nights at Freddy's, from most Five Nights at Freddy's 2 saves that people have made. And um, as you can see, I have Vanoss's super shotgun. Um, and I'm actually going to be killing them all. They're actually possible to kill, and yes, they do work on Big City, um, as you could, as you will be able to see. But before I start killing them, I want to tell you guys something that I may have missed in the last clip. Um, actually, Fredbear's Family Diner, it looks like Golden Freddy had the snout even when he was at Fredbear's Family Diner, so I was thinking that maybe Freddy Fazbear's Pizza was... I mean, Fr Fazbear Entertainment was thinking of revisiting the idea of Golden Freddy as him being the mascot because all the other ones have um, been malfunctioning. So only one to deal with would be what would be like four less, I think. So um, anyway, guys, I just wanted to point that out um, a bit, and uh, that's something I forgot. And um, we're gonna—I'm gonna get ready to kill these guys in three, two, one. Okay, now as you can see, they're all coming for me. You can see that they're all running. This is more than usual. And, um, hang on. Oh, wait, hang on, I forgot. Okay, did I undo the balloon boy? I had a balloon boy guy. Shoot. I'm so, I'm lagging so bad right now. Run 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 run. I am lagging badly. I really should get a different gun. trying to kill these guys foxy almost caught up die puppet die puppet and I died I reskinned um, the puppet to look like foxy uh, respawn I had a bunch of ammo, uh, let me just get the super shotgun. There we go, okay, I'm still lagging like crazy. Uh, once I kill less of them, there will be less lag. They're all coming for me. <laughs> I'm trying to run. they go where did they go where did they go where'd they go okay well, seriously where'd they go oh there they are there they are there they are they all came out of the alley there they are five nights at Freddy's city 
die. Man, these guys have a lot of health. And yes, these guys will die. As cause I killed Foxy back there. There's Shadow Bonnie. I killed old Bonnie. Ah, run, it's Golden Freddy. Ah, die! I killed Golden Freddy. Die, puppet! These guys have a lot of health. Oh no, oh no, no! Oh, phew. This is turning out really long for a theory video. But hey, this is game theory, like time, distance. Yeah, That was dangerous. I got Toy Bonnie. Now I have Shadow Bonnie, Toy Freddy, um, Old Chica, New Chica, Toy Chica, and Old Freddy left. This will be easy. I got Shadow Bonnie. I got old Chica. All that's left is Toy Chica, Toy Freddy, and Old Freddy. I know this is turning up really long, but hey, this is really cool. You guys gotta try this. Um, the creator of these toy models' name is 6INS. Um, you just need to download the save for for his map. Okay, I got Toy Chica. You just need to download the save for his map, and what I did is that I um, duplicated all the models. Okay, all that's left is old Freddy. Freddy Fazbear! Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Fazbear, we meet again. Freddy Fazbear. Freddy. Uh, Freddy! Got him! Alright, now real quick, I'm going to show you guys all the models that I put on top of this roof. I do have the withered um, animatronics models from Five Nights at Freddy's 2, but they wouldn't work on the NPCs. So that's pretty much explains it. And yes, these are all, I just um, straight up duplicator spawned them all. Um, where's the duplicator? Uh, duplicator, here we are. Duplicator. Show save to dupl duplications. I duplicated a bunch of these all fr straight from the map. I altered the Golden Freddy with the head of it, but that's it. All these, all the rest of these were from the map. Even this Foxy, even though it doesn't really look like he's running. So these are all the models that I used. Um, Freddy, he looks pretty cool. Chica looks cool. Bonnie looks cool. All them look cool. And um, I'm interested in Shadow Bonnie. Because it's really cool. So, yeah, anyway, guys, I just wanted to point out that thing that I said th at the beginning of this clip. And, um, subscribe to my. S like, comment, rate, and subscribe, as always. And I will talk to you guys later. Yo, what is up, guys? Nick here. And, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, the last clip was supposed to be the end, but I forgot to mention something. And it's about this picture specifically here. Um, this. This picture was found on scottgames.com, and I said that they would revisit the idea on Golden Freddy, because it would be one last, because it would be um, four less um, animatronics to deal with, and they already scrapped the toy ones, as you could see in this picture, and um, I actually see a light in, in Toy Bonnie's head, so maybe they'll come back, but still, um, they'll, maybe they'll come back like the withered ones in the second game, and... Um, also, what I wanted to point out is that it wi Fre it won't take place at Fred Bear's family diner because it's in the future. Scott is teasing to us that um the third game takes place after the toys are scrapped, which is after night six in the second game. So if it really does take place after the se after the second game, then that means it takes place between Five Nights at Freddy's um two and f and possibly Five Nights at Freddy's one, possibly. Or maybe it might take place after the first game. I don't know. 
Timeline is Fredbear's Family Diner, location that was left to rot so far from the game theory. Um, Five Nights at Freddy's 2 placed in 1987. Five Nights at Freddy's 1 placed in 1993. This Five Nights at Freddy's 3 might take place between those two, except I don't know where it would be in the timeline. Scott is probably trying to figure that out right now. Um, and seriously, it's like a big brain twister to find out where the timeline is. Um... So, yeah, guys, I just wanted to point out that it will take place after Five Nights at Freddy's 2, as you can see, because the toys are scrapped. Yeah, you can see right here, um, Toy Bonnie's arm, Balloon Boy, Toy Bonnie, Foxy's arm, Mangle, um, part of Mangle's ear, possibly, Toy Freddy hat, and Toy Freddy beak, and off this way is supposed to be the Golden Freddy guy that I already showed. Um... Yeah, so anyway, guys, I just wanted to point that out, because I forgot to say it in the last two clips, and, uh, I hope you guys enjoy, uh, and I will, t as always, comment, rate, subscribe, like, and subscribe, and I will talk to you all later.